How's it going, sisters, mates? This is Mr. Charles. We're back with Final Fantasy II, the second one. It's the one after one. I think we know that from primary school or whatever. One plus one equals two. You know, it's just basic maths, really. All right. But previously, I got lost in the middle of nowhere. Not particularly looking for to. Wait a minute. What's that? Oh. Well, I guess I've got something to do with myself now. Pray tell what's in Kashuan Keep. And that's something that's gonna try and, oh, I'm poisoned, great. I'm poisoned, oh, and also, um, I don't really have much health to begin with. Well, guys fucked. Fucked up the anus. Not gonna like that, but hey, I mean, there must be something useful up here. Maybe I'll find some mithril. I mean, isn't that what we're looking for? I think, I hope, uh, I don't know, who cares. <laughs> no, I mean, there has to be something up here. Maybe I'll find a nice little boss battle and, and panic for my life and hope I don't die. Ha, ah, that's gonna be good. That's gonna be great. All right, cool. Good stuff. Yep, go for it. All right, so got got an antidote. Well, finally, that actually seems useful. But um, well, I can find use a potion at least. Yep, good for me. I don't think potions are meant to do that. I don't think they're meant to explode and sparkle. But if you if you insist, that needs to happen. All right, I'm gonna hold back on saving for now. Oh, fire! The sun fire blazes brightly. I'm gonna learn that. I can't learn it. Can I, uh, uh, ask it about an airship? Uh, okay, apparently fire I can't talk. This isn't house moving fortress or castle, whatever it is. Uh, okay, that, that can wait then. I get, it's not gonna let me through, is it? The door is locked. Brilliant. Astounding. Amazing. I got poisoned for nothing then. Ah, oh, there's more of them. Great. Really can't wait to learn some actual magic. Some actual Hogwarts of Adekadabra bullshit. Unfortunately, we're a long, 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 long away away from that, aren't we? I was feeling quite sure that this isn't even the way to go. I only say that because I did do a little bit of Final Fantasy 2 in my teenage years. And I don't think I ever came here. I feel like I'd recognize this area if I did. So, yeah, again, kind of stuck, kind of don't know what to do with myself, but it's cool. I mean, I know what I need to do at least, which is better than what I had before. Okay, got loads of shit there. Nothing can do around there. And then I got caught up again. Oh, a zombie and a dead head. Well, if it's dead, how can it fucking do shit to me? How can it be harmful? I guess this makes sense where all the zombies came from, though. From this evil fort of evilness. Man, it, it, it just didn't care for that arrow, did it? All right, fine. Please go away now. Please, I'll stab you. Good. Can I get my evasion up from that? Okay, well, some health. Uh, that's just nice, I guess. Okay, that was completely useless. Can I at least, like, know what that is, though? What did I, um... What did I guess? That was Kashuan Keep. I guess that's useful. It's not really, but, um... You know, fuck it. Uh, enlarge map. Uh, I can scroll with... Okay, cool. Shame doesn't say what bit's what, but I can handle that. So, what's down south? Is that, like, a, a ferry or... Oh no, isn't that Basque? No, Basque over there. So, what's the... What's that thing? Okay, well I guess I've got somewhere I can go now. I guess. I've still got to fucking wane my way through. Bloons? Oh no, I didn't know Bloons could be harmful to the environment. Please tell me these guys aren't going to kill me. Nah, no, they can't be... They're harmless, I hope. Please be harmless. Ah, that's not harmless. That's, that's... That's a bit better, to be honest. Okay, fine. Okay, die. Good. Alright. It's fine. The enemies are just getting stronger. They've been to the gym. Been doing some dumbbells. Doing a bit of weight lifting. But it's okay. Because so has Guy, apparently. Even though, you know, he's suffering and fucking... Ah, oh, maybe one of us has cure magic. Maybe, maybe I've been neglecting cure magic, actually. Because we've got plenty of mana to go around, thanks to Minwu. Alright, whatever, but uh, those guys died. Can I at least get like a million level ups? Oh wait, we don't do those, do we? Alright, we get the stamina, a bit of staff level increase, whatever that means. Uh, uh, chocobo for us, what the fuck? Can I find a chocobo? Can I adopt one? H Hello? Chocobo? Are you there? Oh, a chocobo! Hey friend! You found a chocobo! Cool! So, what? No, 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 I want to go on the chocobo. Yep, I, I don't care. Speed! 
Yeah, look at me go. Well, I'm a chocobo now. Was that was that all I was going towards? That that was it. Cool. Okay. Well, I can still do a 0 to 60 in 3.5. That makes me happy, I think. And I'm not having to hurt anything. I can actually get through the game without being injured and dealing with bullshit. Until, you know, I have to start attacking stuff. I'm really surprised I'm not bumping into any enemies yet, though. I don't want to jinx it, but, uh... So can I actually explore the map without having to deal with enemies now? Dude, yes! Oh, I can actually explore the game! I'm... Oh, what's that? What's any of this? Alright, I don't... I don't trust this at all, but... Uh, pray to help... No! Shit! It doesn't do anything! Oh, God! Alright, but I... Oh, please tell me I... Oh, no! Why? Why, Chocobo? Oh, that sucks! That Chocobo led me to my death! There's nothing I can do, I have to die. And I was hesitating to save for some reason. God damn it, why? I was exploring the map, I was having a good time. Ah, uh, where's this? Yeah, it can't be that far away. All right, look, we'll find the choke bow again and then fucking, I know more or less where I'm going. Yep, cool, find the, yep, cool. Right, choke bow, where are you little fucker? Now I know how you work, I'm gonna have to fucking be careful with you, aren't I? Right, on the choke bow. Shema can't, like, moor you up to a station or some shit. Oh, that sucks. That sucks royally. Okay. But it's not the end of the world because, again, this guy could be useful to me. So I, I'm pretty sure I don't want to go south because that's going to be too dangerous for me. M maybe the Choco could take me somewhere, but I don't trust that. So, I'm going to travel to the north. See if I can find that, that, that beta, do whatever I was meant to do up there. I mean, there's no reason why I shouldn't be able to. I've just got to be careful. I mean, on, on the bright side, let's appreciate what we've got. We've got a way of navigating, of scouting the area. And it's even a bit more fun than just willy-nilly fucking trying to find an airship, get to the end of the game. Oh, you've got it now, but you've explored everywhere. All right, whatever. Um, um, so here's an area. I, I could risk this. All right, bye, Chocobo, thank you. What's this area? Salamand. All right, I'm sure we've mentioned this place five or six times, so let's go for this. And it's clearly not going to kill me because I'm in a village. Heck, I can even heal myself if I can find the right thing. It's nice and snowy. I miss snow. Hello. Semet Falls is beyond the mountain range to the south of Salamand. That's where the... Ah, Mithril. Okay, good. I can actually use that. You give me a, a helpful tip. I had the strangest dream last night. I was chasing the flame around, but then lost sight of it at a fork in the road. And when I finally caught it, I woke up. All right, that's not useful. I don't know why you told me that, you weirdo. Go back on your drugs, you drug overlord. Please, I, I insist. Take a bit of my crystal meth, if you will. All right, fine, whatever. It's not the end of the world. I mean, I suppose, like, you know, it was a fun thing to learn about. All right, we were in Salamand. I go to the south. I find the mithril mine. And maybe that's what was hidden in the mountains? The mithril mine? I don't know. Uh, clearly I can't do anything about it yet. Yeah, maybe this other lady can help me. The Empire's enslaved the men of Salaman and forced them to work in the... Yeah, I knew that. Please, you have to help them. Yep, yeah, no, I plan to. Uh, I love Joseph, but I know that when I'm around, I just get in his way. Well, maybe you should, like, cook him a meal or something. Do you think... Do you think I'm not saying that in a kind of, oh, you're the woman of the house. I mean, in a sense that maybe you'll appreciate it. The way to a man's heart is through his stomach. I mean, that's one thing I love about Katie so much. <laughs> oh my gosh, she was a good cook. Right, what we got? Life tome. I could use that. But no one seems to want to learn it. Alright, cool. Well, again, useless spells. I miss spells being good in this game. They're just, they haven't been good for a while. I'm just saying. I miss that. Alright, fine. Well, good news is we found Salaman. Bad news is there's now a million fucking hornets and a queen bee. Yep, go away. I'm going to whack you. Wacky one. Man, you see this scene here with all the fucking 
bees and hornets. That's basically my life when I go to bed, except they're all mosquitoes, so maybe not, but still. Ah, uh, this place of mosquitoes. They're different from English ones. Like, in Britain, they're quite big and stuff, and like, you know, you don't see them and shit, and you never hear them. But here, they make the most annoying zzz. I don't know if I mentioned this on the channel before, but they, they're very, very, very annoying. And they never let you sleep. So I now sleep with a book next to me. Here it is. I sleep with this next to me so I can whack them one. That's actually a book I, I use for my Let's Plays. I actually use it to kind of key in certain numbers to make the sizes of the uh, borders and stuff. I, I'm just saying, it's bullshit. And if you say, oh, I'll get bug spray, well, unfortunately, I use that shit. I've got like two canisters. And, and neither of them work anymore because I guess I got used to it. I can get a net, but I have to use Lazada. And, and I, don't, I, I don't know how and I don't have the money. Ah, I make this, this Let's Play so entertaining by talking about a certain financial crises, don't I? All right, final one. It, it doesn't matter. At least when I have headphones on, my ears are safe. As much as the bites are annoying, and I've got a few somewhere on my body, I've forgotten where they are. But they are there. The worst thing is the sound. And then being woken up and being like, shit, I don't want to get bitten. It's the fear. There's nothing to fear but fear itself. I keep thinking I'm playing some kind of like old PS1 game. So I think circle is X and X is circle. Which is very good of me. Right, yeah, you can try it. Yeah, brilliant. Amazing shot, but now you're dead. That's what you get for bullying me. I'm an anti-bullying campaign. And you guys are going to jail. The great jail in the sky. Alright, fine. Again, really trying to make those battles fun, but they're just not. <laughs> they're not fun to watch. They're not fun to do. And I don't even need to level up at this point. Alright, I, I could refer to my map. But I don't really have anywhere I can get... Oh, wait a minute. Maybe I can just go right and then it will lead me to the mountain? Uh, probably not. Ah, oh, this is just inconvenient. Alright. But what's to the left then? Apparently there's, something to the, there's a cave. Is it a useful cave? Can I go through it and find something? Probably not. Maybe I should have used the walkthrough before I started this Let's Play. But I, I wanted to believe I could find it myself, you know? Do the myth or mine, become the hero, and say that, hey, I did this with my brain. My um, one gigabyte round brain. Really, really useful stuff. Right. Yeah, right outside the entrance. Thank you for that. <sighs> Fine. I'm nearly finished Ghost of Tsushima. Like, it's taken its time, don't get me wrong, but like, you know, after getting all the collectibles and stuff, I've got all the, the foxes and fucking... I've just finished all the little temple run things. I don't... Uh, I don't care for this. There's nothing here that's useful as far... Oh, what's this? You hear a voice from nowhere. Do you seek to break his seal? Or this seal? Then by your word, so shall the seal be undone. Uh, Mithril. Good? What happened? Um... All right, I'm in a dungeon now. Why not? Oh God, a Sasquatch. I'm dead. I'm definitely dead. Or not. Oh, I could survive this. Sorry, I thought Sasquatch would be an actual genuine threat to my party. But actually they're worse than the goblins thus far. So worse, they're, they're, they're easier than goblins. Well, except that guy survived a bow and arrow. A goblin wouldn't have done that. Okay. Well, I don't know what would be the end of this. And I'm guessing it's just like an extra dungeon bit. You know, try and make things a bit more exciting by including even more random encounter battles, which I can't be asked for. Javelin, cool, I don't need that. C can I just get out of here, please? I, I don't really need this for myself or my family. My family of one. <laughs> Me. Alright, fine, cool, great. Man, they're not even doing damage. Sh shouldn't, um, don't enemies normally do that? They, 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 they injure? Well, I mean, that, that was a two, and that, that was a, oh, that was a one. We're really moving on up in life from our zeros. All right, fine. Well, again, it's a relief these guys are easy, but I still kind of want to go against something that would actually want to be, be a bit difficult. Okay, a well, another chest. Is it another javelin? No, it's a buckler. This really feels pointless. I don't know why I went down here. Uh, I was just hoping that there'd be something different in this cave. I would have thought I could get something useful out of it, okay? 
I mean, I guess it'll make leveling up more fun, but still. Uh, okay, there's loads of wells, but again, I can't do anything with a well. Well! Yeah, completely stuck. I mean, again, like, I know I meant to get from Mithril, but like, where, where do I go for that? This is a problem with a Final Fantasy or an early Final Fantasy map, anyway. Like, yeah, they say, they say locations you've been and all that, but that's not really helpful, is it? Alright, going through this bit. Is there, is there a map of this underground? Oh, no! No, no, no! Why? Come on, I've increased my evasion lately! Come on, Maria, she's small, nimble, and fast. No, oh, fuck me. People say Final Fantasy XIII is a bad game, but you know one thing I like about Final Fantasy XIII? The enemy kind of runs at you, and if you're fast enough to dodge, well guess what? You don't have to go against the enemy. Everyone says Final Fantasy VII and Final Fantasy X are great Final Fantasy games, but you know what? They still have these random encounters that are undodgeable. You know? Oh, and you know another thing Final Fantasy? They have an extinction thing and Lightning Returns, which I always always loved about it. I loved the fact you could kill all the enemies and then they won't come back for you ever again once you've killed like the alpha or whatever. But in this game, no, they continue forever. Oh, oh, you're level 99? You can't do anything else for yourself? Well, unfortunately, no, you have to keep going. Alright, you know what? I'm gonna end the episode and next time I'm gonna figure a way out of this dungeon. But if you wanna play games and see if you can like escape this misty nightmare, there'll be a link to the game in the description down below. Without further ado, Look out for a book scrubbing chance, it's time. See ya!